A what? Oh, a trophy for being a dog? Yeah. That wouldn't be a good idea. Why? Because he, he's just a dog, you know? Nice special. <clears throat> Did you break this or? No, I just need the pin that goes right there. No, I mean, but that's not, that's not what it's I not asked. Broken, no. Mm. That's cute. But it has my favorite color on it. Where? Where was it? Was it in, in the middle room or? Uh, I don't remember. Mm. Man. He'd be happy that you kept his promise that you were going to. I mean, with God's help that you were going to see me back here so you would give it to me. Some people say they're going to give something to somebody and they don't. You know, just they'll, they, they'll be greedy and they'll keep it, you know. And I'm keeping it, you know. Yeah. F them uh, non-profit people, you know. Some people are like that. Um. Oh, yeah, yeah, somebody did that rudely. You know when you go to a restaurant and you put tip on the table? Mm -hmm. And somebody that was greedy, after my dad put the tip there, so, you know, he went to you with somebody, I don't know if it was family or friend, but he he, he returned to the table real fast. He goes, no, these $5, man, they, they'll help me with something. He took the, I don't know how much it was, if it was 5 or 20 bucks, mm -hmm. and he went back and took the tip off the table where my dad had put it. And I mean, that's rude, man. He goes, he said something like, what the F you putting a tip there, you know, I could, I could surely use this money here, you know, like saying it's going to waste, you know. And then, uh, Next time you go to lunch with that mom, mm -hmm. collect everybody's money. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Pay the bill. And then give the waiter, waitress the tip personally. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good, that's even better. There's people that do that a lot. Yeah. And they're so dumb enough that they ended up getting caught. They get caught all the time because um, they're dumb. Just because they don't see the, the hidden cameras, they think they can, you know. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, you, you know. Just pay attention to things. The next time you go to lunch or something like that with somebody that's like that, mm -hmm. just take charge of this shit. Just collect everybody's money, their for whatever they're paying for their mm -hmm. part of the bill. Mm -hmm. Or have everybody give a bill, get their own individual bill. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You mm -hmm. can do that. Mm -hmm. That's true. And then when you pay your bill, give your tip to them, to them at the same time. That's probably why some places they have this thing where you pay the tip to the register, you know? Yeah. Because people do that kind of shit. Well, you know, it's going to be tempting. It's cash money sitting there on the table. There's nobody around. Mm -hmm. Some people think, well, they think of it as extra money that you're going to pay like you know, that they need for gas or whatever. Yeah. And they think it's a waste of money that you leave. You're just going to, like, they think that you're just throwing it, like, throwing it in a trash can, you know? Yeah. Mm. Obviously, those people have never worked for tips before. Mm hmm Because most jobs mm -hmm. that you get tips. Mm hmm 
The reason you're allowed to get tips is because you don't make shit. Yeah. So that's why they allow you mm -hmm. to get tips. Mm -hmm. So if you do a good job and it and it gives you motivation to work harder mm -hmm. and do a better job. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. A lot of people that work in jobs where you get tips, if they didn't get those tips, mm -hmm. they couldn't do that job because they wouldn't make enough money. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Because I've had those jobs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And your regular pay, when you get your paycheck, mm -hmm. it's minimum wage. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. it's the minimum that mm -hmm. by law they can pay you to work. Mm -hmm. What makes it worthwhile mm -hmm. and makes it to where you can live is the tips. Mm -hmm. Are you required to give tips? No. Mm -mm. But it's been my experience. Most people tip. Some people don't. Some people can't. Mm -hmm. It's okay. That's true. There's no, they're not required to give you a tip. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. You're hired to do the job. You mm -hmm. get a paycheck to do the job to serve them mm -hmm. while they're there. Mm -hmm. So they don't have to give you a tip. And if they don't tip you, you have no right to get an attitude about it. Unless it's like, Obviously, that they're just, you know, taking advantage of the situation and, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Really making you jump through hoops and all this kind of shit and then they don't give you a tip. Well, you know, but people do that shit too. You just gotta, you know, let it go. But most people, 90 plus percent, all you gotta do is do a good job and you'll get tips. Mm -hmm. If people will notice. You don't think people notice, but they do. Mm -hmm. I always make good tips. Mm -hmm. Because I do my best. I don't bullshit around. Mm -hmm. I do the most efficient job I can do for the people and get it done as quickly as possible so they can be on their way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And nice about it at the same time. I always make good tips. Mm -hmm. Well. <laughs> it's easy to make good tips, man. Do your job and be nice. I usually don't... The tips don't cross my mind. I just do my job and I don't even think about that extra money. Like, You know what I'm saying? Because when people... These people, when they... Thinking about money and that's how many tips you're gonna get and all this, and then they gotta be nice to this person and but not the ones that don't tip. When they start doing that kind of shit, they stress too much. When they start distinguishing that they're not gonna go to someone's table just because they never tip or they don't tip much or whatever, you know. Yeah. There was this one good dude that used to be popular for going there just to drink coffee for four like four hours or so. Yeah. And he liked to, I guess, conduct his meetings there, and he'd be like asking the waitresses for a, to serve him more yeah. coffee. And somehow this whole thing got going around about how, oh, you're supposed to to tip ten percent of the bill. Mm -hmm. Who says that? Uh, where in any mm -hmm. law manual, rule book, anywhere? Where does it say that? Mm -hmm. Anywhere that you're supposed to tip ten mm -hmm. percent of the bill. Mm -hmm. Nowhere. You know who made that shit up? Mm -hmm. Motherfuckers that work for tips. Mm -hmm. People that work for tips. Mm -hmm. And it's like, you can't mandate and tell somebody how much they should pay you for doing your fucking job in the first place. Mm -hmm. You should have a little more gratitude. Mm -hmm. I don't care if they come in there and their bill's $150. If they tip you a dollar, mm -hmm. that's good. Who give you 10%? Mm -hmm. Who says who? 
the where government. Is that, where does it say that at? In any law or anything? Nowhere. The government. <laughs> I'm sorry. You want more tips? Maybe you should work on improving your ability to do your job. You know what I'm Maybe you need to be a little more efficient. Maybe you need to be a little more courteous. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know? well, think about that. Who's in trouble, baby? Who? Yeah, I'm just trying to look at people like imagine that waiter, waitress working there is your brother or your sister or your mom or your dad. You know what I'm saying? And they did an excellent job for you, mm -hmm. right? Because mm -hmm. that's part of why you get more or less tips too is how efficient are you doing at your job mm -hmm. how many times do they have to get up and go find you to get a, a refill mm -hmm. how many times you walk past their table and their their plate is empty and their cup is empty and you just mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and they have to uh, excuse me miss sir could i get a refill could, would you take this empty plate or you know what i'm saying Mm -hmm. People that make those tips, they're on it. They see it. Boom, 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 boom. Done. Out of there. They're paying attention. Mm -hmm. People like that. Mm -hmm. They respect it. You know what I'm saying? And then they're like, man, this motherfucker's on. Wow, man. I think I said this motherfucker's on drugs. What are you were saying? They are efficient. Oh. <laughs> those are the people that have. Uh, let me call it um, reliable customers, like repeat customers, loyal customers, mm -hmm. because they're efficient at their jobs. Mm -hmm. You see all these other motherfuckers going mm -hmm. around bitching and shit mm -hmm. and griping. Meanwhile, over here in their section of the restaurant, they got a table of people over there with empty, you know, plates of food is they're finished with. All the fucking cups are empty. Nobody has any drinks. And you're standing over here fucking griping. I'm wondering why you don't make shit in tips and everybody else making all the money. You ain't doing shit, motherfucker. Care about your job. You know what I'm saying? Try to do a good job for people. Overtime, every day, first time. See if they're going to school. I bet it does. This one is number 123. And we got some bonus. I always need good money and tips, man. We're going to do a good job for people as, as quickly as possible mm -hmm. without sacrificing quality. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. Ouch. Mm -hmm. yeah, you don't want to be going too fast to where it's just all fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Well, at least these fouls fast. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Well, you don't get rewarded for fast, shitty service. Mm. No. They used to work at Arizona Charters in the restaurant. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's, that's, you know, mm -hmm. that's, this is a tough job to do because you don't make shit. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. you got to bust ass, man. You really do. And it gets busy and shit, and you're, you're working your ass off. Mm -hmm. 
the minimum wage. But most people out Oops. there, you know, you know what's up. That's why you tip. Yeah, I know. That's why I tip. Mm-hmm. A lot of times people just say, oh, I'll just tip a dollar and that's good. And it is. You know what I'm saying? That's mm-hmm. cool. It's better than nothing. And uh, at least you tip something. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Me personally, like when I used to make money and I was making money, had money, I mm-hmm. tip 20s, Damn. 10s. Mm-hmm. All the time. Mm-hmm. All the time. If I had it, Boom, it's a 20 for you, man. Because mm-hmm. they did a good job. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, I didn't have to do anything. They were efficient. I didn't have to, like, uh, excuse me, nothing. Mm-hmm. They were on it, man. They were working hard. If I had it, always, dude, 20 bucks. Yeah. And they'd be like, uh, sir, you gave too much money. I was like, no, that's for you. And I was like, what? What? That's for you, man. Fucking did an awesome job. So, yeah. I work for tips, too. So, yeah, that's why I gave you a $20 tip. Because, shit, man, you fucking deserve it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fun to make people's day, like, well, no, I have a cousin, somebody that gave her a $100 tip. Yeah. But it was a big restaurant. It was... I never gave a $100 tip because I never made that much money. Mm. But I would routinely tip $20, $10, $5. Mm. At the very least, $2, two to $3. Mm. At the very least. Mm. But if I had money and my bills were paid and all that kind of shit, dude. Mm-hmm. Once, only once in my life did I ever get a twenty dollars tip. Only once. I forgot to ask you that you see. I tell you what, mm-hmm. it was cool too because that day, mm-hmm. it was I had like. Less than an hour left to go on my shift. I didn't make a single cent for tips the whole day. Mm-hmm. Nothing. There was like less than an hour left on my shift. Mm-hmm. Person uh, left the casino. Mm-hmm. I went and picked up their car and when I brought it back. They gave me a twenty dollar tip. Mm-hmm. I didn't think I was gonna make shit that day. Like absolutely nothing zero for tips. That was the thing I loved about uh, jobs where you can receive tips, though. It's like, no matter how broke you are, Mm -hmm. every day you're going to leave there, you're going to have some fucking cash in your pocket. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You're going to have some cash in your pocket. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Every day. Oh, my God. I love that, dude. Like, even if it was only, you know, 20, 30 bucks, Mm -hmm. still. You, every day you're going to leave there with some cash money in your pocket. Oh, that helps a lot. Especially when you run out of gas money or... Because when you, you get... Pack of cigarettes. Yeah, because when you get a check, you spend it all, right? And then that way you go to work, you, get, you have money every day. You know what I'm saying? So I know what you're saying. So you're never broke, pretty much. Well, I mean, you're still broke, but you can put some gas in your car and get a pack of cigarettes. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Whereas if you're not making tips mm-hmm. and you run out of gas, but now you gotta borrow money or something, you gotta figure out something. Mm-hmm. Or do without, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, that's it. I always mean decent tips, man. Not the best. I wasn't up to, like the top mm-hmm. person mm-hmm. as far as getting tips goes. Mm-hmm. But I was definitely wasn't the bottom either. 
You know what I'm saying? Because mm-hmm. I don't really do my best to give the customers the most efficient, quickest service of my ability. You know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. I ain't fucking around, mm-hmm. you know, hang out and, and talk and all this other shit. Like, mm-hmm. I should be doing my job, you know? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I want to try to get shit done as quick as possible. Mm-hmm. Get them on their way, because I know they got shit to do. Yep. Yeah, he went up. <laughs> when you have to be not all the time there was a surgeon at the hospital in Memphis mm-hmm. used to come to the casino mm-hmm. pretty pretty often mm-hmm. a couple times a month watch mm-hmm. out now you're gonna rip my shit off the wall what 